So this is apparently the O snap. The O snap. The O snap. O snap. 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 O O O snap. Don't worry, this isn't the casting couch. <laughs> In fact, you're the one who put me here. Mm. So this is a thing. This is a thing. That you uh, gave to me at the last war, which I was uh, under some kind of random pill that a stranger gave me because I hurt my knee very badly. Coked out of his gourd. According to him, I don't remember any of this. That pill, I don't know what it was, but it was very, very nice. That being said... I did come home with a couple of goodies, and this was one of those goodies. And honestly, I thought it was for me. But apparently, I'm supposed to do a video on it, and then he's supposed to send it back. I guess. Indeed. This uh, comes to us from Jimmy Barr, who has sent me many an awesome care package. At least, I really hope that's who this was from, or I'm going to feel like a right. I have a feeling that they'll let us know down in the comments. Section. Most likely. If this wasn't from you, let us know, and uh, we'll do apologize you, profusely. Do you and I'll know do if they even watch my channel? I, they do. They asked me to, to show oh, okay. this off on your channel. Awesome. Uh, they asked me to hand this to you so we can do a video on it. So here we are in his shop. I finally lovely. had another snap fire. And, and now... And now it's gone. It's gone. But it your that just says how cool this thing was. This is a legitimately really awesome snap fire. A build I will most likely copy. Mm. So this is apparently... The, the O snap. snap frame a little bit and it comes in a very nice package a very very nice package and it says use it wisely or not and uh, really impressively cut out I know right they did a really good job on this I'm guessing yeah. that's a ramrod no it's actually the uh, the it goes through the back so you can prime it more easily <laughs> sure why not yeah so it doesn't need a ramrod I've never actually cronied this or anything. I don't think I've even fired it yet. I've had it sitting next to my desk planning on doing a video on it. And uh, never did a video on it. Did you ever like, fire it or anything? I think I fired it when I first took it out of the box. Now you see why you have that ring. Well, I'm going to refuse to yeah. use the ring because that's just the kind of dude I am. Right. And, uh, well, I have a target standing here. Yep. yep. How was that? Eh. Not that bad? Nah. I'm going to fire it once more, and then I'm going to hand it off to you. And this is, like, you haven't seen the cool part about this yet. You're probably wondering why this thing looks so freaking goofy. And there's a reason for that. Oh, no, that's totally awesome. Yeah. I would use the crap out of that. Why don't you demonstrate its super secret super function? So, in addition to being having a brass barrel and a, a, a very sizable spring upgrade, um, and the dead space removed and all the, the, the mods that you did. In fact, I think he said he followed your mod guide. Yeah, <laughs> probably. He then built a silencer onto it. Suppressor. A suppressor, yeah. Which supposedly actually does. Oh my god, does! It it seriously does make it, it quieter. And it doesn't av adversely affect the, the performance. That's really neat. There's actually like holes drilled into it. Like it almost has baffling. Oh, it, it is. And then he wrapped it in what looks to be like cast tape? Yeah, that, that casting. He genuinely built a Nerf suppressor. That is balls to the wall amazing. I didn't know One that. One more time. I'm going to use the... Ram it comes with a, a priming oh. hook. I keep thinking... That is amazing! I have many of questions. I mean, you'd never think to do that, but... It works! It works! And it's, it's actually got, like, a whole barrel, like, he, he thought another, this through. I need another dart. Give me a dart. Like, I'm trying to figure out exactly how this thing even went together. Because there's, like, a piece of PVC and a bunch of putty, and I'm impressed. So that's what it normally sounds like. Now we're going to look like idiots because there's not actually a suppressing effect. I'm pretty sure there is. No, there is. I mean, we always look like idiots, but at this point... I mean, it's our job. It is, actually. I mean, if, if we look... We're here to entertain the masses. If we look smart, people wouldn't comment half as much. Indeed. And they'd have nothing to say. That is that is really cool. I don't know how he did it. I'm really upset this has to leave. Yeah. 
There's but, pretty involved and tape involved and baffling. And I have no idea how this guy did this. This is amazing. Yeah. Like the putty job and it's like he doesn't. I want to try it on a larger scale now. Oh gosh. This is. Because oh. see, I like how pointable it is with that extra little bit of barrel on it. Because mm -hmm. he actually mm -hmm. extended the barrel out quite considerably. Yeah. And then with this on it, it's just like just like Counter Strike. Oh, it's so nice. That is pretty cool. Oh, so nice. Well, that's perfect. I need another Snapfire now. Do you have an extra Snapfire by chance? I might. I might. Because I think if, somebody, somebody, if I know somebody sent me one, one, and I know I had one. See, I don't have one at all anymore. I will check I really miss it, because I treated one to a kid in a war for that purse blaster. Oh. Which seemed like a good idea to yeah. me. He was super happy to have a mod from me. That's what happens when you come to our wars and you have something that I want. <laughs> and I go, do you want one of these? And they were like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, sure, to do it, take it. And I've missed it ever since because it was my war pistol for a long time. I will check my bins. Uh, Jimmy? Jimmy. Jimmy Barr, I, I'm hoping. Hopefully. It's going to be hilarious when I upload this and it's not that <laughs> He's good. like, that was me! That's not Jimmy! Jimmy's going, I don't know what's This is the on. most, this is probably the worst video. You, you, you goaded me into sitting on this couch and doing this video. Yep. And now I'm seriously regretting this because, again, we're both going to look like complete idiots when it's like, no, it was Ashley, it actually, Ashley something, mm. or whatever. I can check. You're going to have to. We have the technology. I'll just cut to you after you find the answer. Rainbow pistol suppressed. <laughs> Rainbow pistol suppressed. <laughs> like seriously, this is that'd be amazing. You see how much fun I'm having? I might have to see if there's some way he'll let me keep it. <laughs> Maybe I can send him money or blaster. <laughs> it is Jimmy Bar. It is Jimmy Bar. Jimmy Bar. Oh snap! Yes, like, right. oh, I didn't want to read your email. Never mind. But, yeah. So it was Jimmy. It was Jimmy. Jimmy, the one who sent me the Ultimator and so many amazing boxes all painted up and just so much cool stuff. And, of course, the one thing of all of it that Wolcom wants to keep, he can't have. Unless know, he right? can, you know, wrangle it out of Jimmy. Of course, yeah, if there's something... entirely possible, Jimmy would have to come here and get it from you if he wanted to. Uh, unfortunately, uncool. yeah, that it would be, be uncool. very uncool. Don't, and don't I'm just that. not a big enough dick. But, Jimmy, let me know, because I actually legitimately really want this now. Um, I will slay many of children with it, and possibly some Xavier, because this is... You'll like, never hear it coming? You, you, you gave a thing to a guy to do a video on that, like, literally he's nothing but pistols and shotguns. And you gave him a suppressed pistol. Yeah. It's just the biggest tease. You take it out of my hand, I'm gonna go crazy. You can't even have it. Um, yeah. If anything, yeah. Oh, my God, he even sealed up the holes in the back with putty? Yeah. Like... I mean, it needs some cosmetic work, obviously. Yeah, but that's that's a little easy. bit of sanding, a little bit more paint. But I mean, that's that that'd be that's easy. easy stuff. But yeah, it's I already like the profile of it. Yeah, like the profile's perfect. Yeah, you mm -hmm. can do a little bit of sanding and putty work and stuff yeah. on it. That's easy. I like that he he did put an orange barrel on it, which that's is very important. Very considerate. I, I like I got a lot of flack from people because I, I really harp about the orange thing. Mm -hmm. um, when I showed off Quincy with the vector kit on it. People are like, oh, well, majority of the blaster is black, or majority of the blaster is orange, so it doesn't matter. You don't need to worry about the orange tip. If I'm pointing that at you, you don't see any <laughs> orange on it. Yeah. In fact, I would almost argue that most of the time, this is not good enough. It's but good. if it's just off slightly, you can see the orange. But legitimately, with that vector kid, if I point that at you, or you're looking at me from far away, and I'm pointing this at somebody and you're behind them, it looks like a real gun. That's the point, and I'm a I'm surprised how many people, I've had people unsubscribe from me for that, because I harp about that so much, and it's a legit thing. I don't know why. Yeah, I'm just a stickler, I guess. But Jimmy, man, Jimmy. that is super cool. And if there's something I can do for it, uh, please email me, because uh, I, I legitimately want it. If not, it's here in the case. It's gonna go back with Captain Xavier for right now. Just is there a ghost over there? Probably. More ghosts. More ghosts. Of course. You're probably but, wondering where, what happened to their intestines. I know, right? We threw out so many ghost intestines today. That's a beautiful thing to call that packaging yeah. material. I'm really jealous you came up with that. That's awesome. Yeah, the stuff I had, uh, the guy who sent me uh, all that Milwaukee stuff, uh, it came like in a huge box, and then there'd be like two small Milwaukee things in this three foot by two foot by two foot box. <laughs> and there'd be two little packs of screwdriver heads. 
And then there would be 90 feet of this blue bubble packing stuff. And, or no, it was, it was uh, aquamarine, like uh, an yeah. ugly green, like yeah. seafoam green. Yeah. Pulling this stuff out by... I've seen all three. I've seen the light blue yeah, and the aquamarine. Feet man. and feet and feet of this. And so he's like, did you get the stuff? I'm like, yeah, I got the box of, of drill bits. And 90 feet of blue whale intestines. Like, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, they love that stuff. But this stuff was clear, so we're yeah. like ghost intestines. Like, nine... Got rid of a lot of it. I still have a bunch in there, but yeah, I yeah. have it saved for sending back that commission that I've been working on. Right, right. Yeah, I, I keep a lot of packing material. I don't even think the person who knows that. that I've been working on this commission for God knows how long even watches my videos anymore. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I went through all my emails and found a couple of things like, oh yeah, I promised I'd do that and a year ago. Oh, I'm a schmuck. I'm not quite that bad. But uh. that's what, it's funny. And this is really random. I don't really care at this point, but this is really rambly. But it's like people don't understand like the whole doing the YouTube thing. Like they think like, oh, well, let's say it takes you 30 minutes to film a 10 minute video, 15 minute video, or maybe you get it in one take and you're just that awesome. It happens sometimes, and then you sit down and edit it. And even if you do like minimal editing, it's still usually like an hour of editing, usually. And that's just doing little things on it, and then of course exporting it, and then uploading it, and putting in all your information. I don't know how well you use tags and stuff like that, but I, I have a set of tags and then I put in new ones in, filling out the things in the description, the title, the thumbnail, that takes a while to do, and you get all that stuff, the cards and the, the, the freaking end cap and all that stuff, and that's not even 1% of it, because then you're constantly answering comments, constantly answering emails, I've got a Facebook I have to get messages from, you've got an Etsy you have to get most of your messages through. No, I get very few from there because I don't oh. have anything uploaded on there, I have nothing listed, and so it's actually hard to find it. <laughs> Interesting. You have to know it's there. And uh, then, but yeah, I get it, you know, Facebook messages, my Facebook page messages, my personal Facebook, email, comments, F, um, Etsy messages, YouTube messages, and then people are going, you should join a Discord! No, because no! <laughs> I have a Discord with I think 1,100 people, and even oh. on like a slow day, like we'll have like 150 fuzzlers, which is just the verified people online. Then we'll have two dozen VIP fuzzlers, and then all the producers, which is the rank like your rank in there. Even though I don't think I've ever seen you say anything in my Discord, you were in my Discord. Hey, yeah, yeah, and you're a producer, which is where all the video and the people that own shops and stuff like that are. <gasps> and like I had to turn off my messages. Because people would just join the Discord and message me. Because that's the only way you could send me a message. And I had to turn that off because I just have so many... My, my, I'd get just, like, my phone would be exploding constantly. And, like, it, they, 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 it takes a lot of time and effort to go through that stuff. That's half the battle when it comes to this job. So it's funny people say that kind of stuff. I guess the title of this is going to be We Unbox a Cool Blaster, Froth Over It. And then complain. <laughs> and then complain about our fame. But, hey, I think we hit that 10 minute mark maybe. Then I <laughs> shove an extra ad break in there, even though nobody will watch more than two minutes of this video. I would hope not. But it's been a while since we've both been on camera together. This is true. And people have been complaining. Have they? Yeah, they have. you, for instance. Oh, yeah, I complain yeah. all the time. I don't get enough of you. <laughs> and now oh, I've had you two weekends in a row. Holy Ooh. crap. But you'll get to see what we accomplished in those two weekends soon. Oh, God, yes. I'm going to shoot that, like, right now. That's going to be fun. Uh, I'm going to go home. Absolutely incredible. That you notice, like, what's this sitting on a couch in a garage thing? It's like, what's going on there? It's like, oh, man. If you had any idea. That's why we keep looking over here at the yeah. shrine. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. Good job, buddy. Yeah. Alrighty. I think it's time to uh, figure out what to do, and we can't forget to take a thumbnail of this. Yep, yep. Yep. So, uh, yep. yeah, uh, I'm Volcom. This is Captain Xavier. And then Luchathor13 is in the background. I you need to come up with a better name. No. It's a cool name. It is. No, Luchathor is fine, but was there really already one Luchathor? Were there no, I, actually, were there I, a dozen Luchathors already? I, I killed them all. Ah. Is that how this works? Yeah. So now you can have other Luchathors. You're going to have Luchathor 14 coming after you? Yeah. Because that's how it works. It's no. like the uh, Assassin's Association. Nobody knows what I'm talking about. That. No that? more heroes! Play it! It's a good game! Anyway, I'm done. Let's freaking escape. Yep, run for it. <laughs> Come back here! Beat you to death with a bump! Come here! You made the mistake of giving me the start. Ah! Ow! That actually got me nice. Yeah, this thing's stupidly accurate. I love it. 
I don't want to give it back! You gotta up, up.